Hi guys, uh, in today videos I will go over uh, the Alliance Conquest battle uh, between HOH and NBA and uh, I have to admit I I have seen many videos on YouTube how uh, dingo dogs killing a lion and uh, <laughs> HOH is not a lion but uh, they have good players and congrats uh, I do appreciate the battle today and I may say we had a good time playing together but at the end of the day uh, the lion was HOH and <laughs> we we played quite good in in this season uh, after all many many of us was not available to play many games but uh, this important game got us to UFC and I want to dive in and I would like to um, to see different views how how we did it and how we pull it out because many people won't believe but everything is strategy and our commander uh, our leaders they know what they're doing and first thing when you hear hook bite fish you will say okay that's something fishy here no nothing fishy just give something to attack distract the enemy and get what you want that's what we did and that's what our officers called hook bite fish and that's what we did today today match was very important for us to go to UFC and very important for HOH of course but uh, we did not not we we did not have anything to lose so we put everything on on table and the the thing is HOH bite bite pretty hard because we give them the outposts they spent a lot of troops there they didn't focus on reinforcing CR and at the end of the day what we did was pretty significant putting some accounts in the ports losing the uh, like weaking them out was our point and our troops was like solid so hook bite fish they bite and we attacked and we win so after all it was not easy to do this it did cost of course but for UFC, uh, we all know that everybody will give anything to go to UFC. And we did it. We did it with significant, uh, not too many kills, uh, but with strategy. Strategy win this game and activity activity was most most important we was missing one person which he missed the the battle with maybe two minutes or so however i don't want to talk about this uh it's great season for nba it was great season for hoh as well and today I will talk about uh, this uh, hook, bite and fish strategy uh, which uh, a, uh, NBA performs in the last minute because uh, the knowledge and the strategy go hand by hand. You, you cannot dismiss one of the two and because NBA have very good uh, officers leading this uh, 
the whole show it's the important importance of winning the, the battles and winning the battles is not uh, just go and uh, take some castle and just win the battle no it's it's luring the enemy to attack you that's what we did today we did lure HOH they bite we played the fish they bite but at the end of the day what happened is everybody knows what happened so few few cents about the strategy how how did it work I am not able to say if I like it or not yes it did cost for many of us not only for me for any for many of us but considering this we don't have anything to lose so why not why not do it do it all in and we went all in and for this season we never had 99 people active that was the first sign that we will win I was not sure at the beginning because we start uh, doing stuff which is not really um, uh, normal for 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 us we start doing it backwards but at the end of the day gives us the points and when that gives the points and when that lures the enemy to attack us and bleed that's good thing and uh, we had significant damages on CR uh, we we made uh, quite a bit of battles there and I have to I have to admit that uh, HOH people I'm not here to judge like I'm here to enjoy the game at the end of the day that was the best game I ever had in last three seasons HOH give us hell of a battle, hell of a fight. I have to admit this. I cannot, I cannot hide it. And there are good people there. And I say hi to all HOH people. I do apologize again that they didn't have a chance to go to UFC they deserve it because this kind of a players deserve to go to UFC they are not cowards no cowards there for sure hell of a fight hell of a rallies just watch the video like you will see what I was like uh, at one point I was like what the heck what the heck is going on like really they are doing rallies and they keep attacking they they didn't give up okay we won the battle we won with strategy not because they're they're worse than us no uh, they're good but we we had strategy in place like we had people working for it to to make them attack fake castles and that did work well I don't know that if that's gonna work well in the next battles but at the end of the day did work against HOH well that's all my five cents uh, you see uh, it's neck to neck battle there they bleeding us on on the ports just in order to kill us and we we come back again and again and again uh, it's it's good thing uh, when you it's good thing when you when you see your team members playing with you it, it's not uh, one man rodeo uh, after all and this match was was great i did personally enjoy it I didn't at at one point I had so many commands 
that I didn't know what to do. Like I, I had like so many troops out. I didn't have troops, and somebody is asking, okay, send troops there, send troops there. Give me troops. Give me uh, field the rallies. Like multitasking is the way to go. And I never dream in my life since I start playing the game that I'm gonna be in one of the top alliances in the game. And NBA is a top alliance in the game. And so far I know the people. Uh, this is only probably alliance in the game. Whatever I'm gonna post something I need and 10 people is gonna ask me, okay, let's let's do it. Let let's let's let me help you. Kind people, no nothing else I can say. Like it's crazy. It's crazy. No uh, no border between higher tier uh, players and lower tier players like me. It's a no border. I can talk to anybody. And at the end of the day, I enjoy. I enjoy this alliance. And I will say, HOH, thank you for the battle today. I really appreciate you. You have good players. And you give us a hell of a fight. It's a matter of luck, probably. You didn't get the mines. If you did, you would have won the match. At the end of the day, thank you to all NBA officers involved in this. I know there are like 15 of them. Everybody has different duties and everybody has like great responsive responsibility and great responsiveness to the players like me i am not max out account i am i am far beyond the people playing in this alliance and i will say only one thing thank you for your uh, great uh, responsiveness and thank you for everything whatever you did for the alliance guys i would like to say please join the videos i will post more and uh, thank you to hoh to make that much so grateful thank you for all the officers in nba to make that much possible and thank you for watching the video if you have any questions or concerns if you if you don't like anything just please just let me know i will be grateful to answer all your questions my name is little kubra in the game you can reach me out on discord or you can you can reach me out in the game and um, if you like the video please give me a thumbs, thumbs up and if you don't like the video please let me know about your concerns I'll be more than happy to change any of the content you don't like I will go over it with you and I will be more than grateful to answer all your questions thank you and stay tuned for next video bye